If you want rich, full-bodied coffee at home, you should use a French press. Here's how to use one. First, boil some water. While your water is boiling, you can prepare your coffee beans. The process of using a French press is similar to making tea. Rather than forcing grounds through a filter, the French press works by steeping. Because of this, you want coarser grounds to release the good stuff. Use a grinder to grind your coffee beans to a consistency along the lines of a very fine gravel, like this. We're going with the Barata Encore Conical Burr Coffee Grinder, which we think is a great entry-level electric grinder with 40 individual grind settings. You can find it linked in the description below, but a manual grinder will work well too. For every cup of coffee you want to make, aim for about three tablespoons of coffee grounds. You can always adjust based on how weak or strong you like your coffee. We're using the Bodum Chambord French Press, our favorite press for its affordability, good looks, and ease of use. You can also find it linked in the description below. Add your beans to the press, then pour in your boiling water. Give it a few good stirs until it starts to foam a bit. The time you want to allow your coffee to steep depends on the roast you are working with and how strong you want it to be. Darker roasts, because they are drier and more brittle, will extract faster than a lighter roast. You can start with trying four minutes for a dark roast and five minutes for a lighter roast. While the coffee steeps, place the plunger on top to keep it hot, but don't press it down yet. When plunging, be sure to do so slowly. Most French presses have an additional lid on top that can pop open with too much pressure from pressing down on the plunger too fast, causing you to get hot water on yourself. Slow and even downward pressure also means you'll end up with a lot less sediment in your coffee. Now simply pour and enjoy. Be careful not to pour all of it because there might be gritty sludge on the bottom. Now say goodbye to your drip coffee maker. If you're looking to make coffee using a French press, use our links below. It won't cost you any extra and we'll earn some money to help support more videos like this.